what is going on YouTube so coming back today with another video that I just wanted to kind of give my opinion about so I've been doing this a lot recently because I think it's a good time to do that you know we're at a point in sports where football is right around the corner and it's about time for me to start going into my previews for it um, but the NBA it's still got a while until the season rolls back around same thing with the NHL same thing with college football still got about a month before that and you know, I think it's a good time to just kind of say what's what's on everyone's mind or, you know, what your opinion is for the next season. Just kind of a good time to, uh, you know, get some intrigue started, you know. I think some people take what other people say a little bit serious, but or a little bit too serious, take it beyond a point. But again, this is just my opinion on it. And for this video, I'm going to be talking about Todd Gurley. Todd Gurley, to me is a guy that just has unlimited potential as a running back. If you read the title, then you know that I think that Todd Gurley has the capability of being the best running back in the NFL this coming season. I'm not saying that he guaranteed will be, because I very rarely say that. I don't have that strong of a hunch. But I believe that he's just got the best combination of factors to lead up to a good season right now. You know, it's been talked about with the Todd Gurley to Steven Jackson comparison, it's there, but they're not the same running back. Um, Steven Jackson was a little bit more gritty running between the tackles. Todd Gurley's a little bit faster, a little bit more elusive, at least in my opinion, because Todd, Todd Gurley was a good return man also in college. So, you know, this is a guy that last year in just 13 games had over 1,100 yards and 10 touchdowns. Little bit of a fumbling problem, but I don't think it's too bad. I think that's something that could be worked out just just because he's a young player. You know, averaging 4.8 yards per carry rookie year on a team that really didn't have much of a passing game, to me, that's a tremendous accomplishment. Also, to me, Todd Gurley is a guy that I feel like he doesn't care what other like about outside factors. That You know, there's a lot of players like that that just will do them no matter what. And I feel like Todd Gurley's that type of player. You could tell that from college when he got in that autograph or autographed helmet scandal thing his senior year, which was so stupid in my mind. But again, that's just another rant on the NCAA. Completely done with that. It, it, again, if you're talking about comparisons for Todd Gurley for who'd be the best running back in the NFL right now, obviously Adrian Peterson. Uh, I'm not saying Todd Gurley's the best running back in the NFL right now. I'm saying by the end of next season, he has the ability to very well be you know Adrian Peterson's reaching that age where man it, it doesn't seem like he has that many years left obviously he hit 30 and you know he's still going strong as hell but overall days are numbered that's just the way it goes for running backs you know Le'Veon Bell sorry about this I'm having I have bug problems last like week but anyway Le'Veon Bell very talented running back could very well also be the best running back in the NFL right now, but he struggles with injury problems. He's been suspended multiple. Actually, I don't think it's been multiple times, probably only once, but you know, he's already had to miss damn near an entire season because of combination of suspension and, and injury problems and that could hamper you being the best running back in the NFL. David Johnson is rumored to not rumored to be, but expected to be one of the better running backs in the NFL this year, at least stats wise. I'm not ready to put him in that category yet. I still think the Todd Girl is a more talented player. Excuse me. That pretty much covers the competition that Todd Gurley has at the top level. And, you know, I think this... I don't think this is the first time that someone's mentioned this. You know, this guy is, what, 20, 21 years old? Yeah. 21 years old. Still got a lot of potential left. Still got a lot of... This is a guy that could have 9, 10 years of being a elite level running back in the NFL and that's really really hard to find all right so that'll pretty much do it for this video like I said I wanted to give a little bit of love out to Todd Gurley and yeah that's pretty much it see ya